On today's show, it's Super Sports Cars. We'll start with a sedate cruise and a half million dollar SLR McLaren Roadster. Then Cato will tear around a racetrack and its newer cousin, the SLS AMG. We'll test drive the top of the line Jaguar XKR and then send Cato back to the track. Listen, listen. In the Lexus LSA. Money's no object. We've got horsepower to burn on car business. Rare are the times we test drive cars worth half a million bucks a copy. Well, I drive them a lot, but, but once in a while we put them in your hands. Capable hands. <laughs> exactly. Well, this one, of course, is the uh, McLaren SLR from Mercedes-Benz. And a rarity. I think maybe 2,000 in the whole world yeah. built. So, so it's a, And that's it. We're at the end of the line. Well, it's a very advanced car, carbon fiber throughout. I, I don't know if there's a piece of steel in the thing. No, oh, I, I think it's about 99% carbon yeah. fiber, so lightweight. It's got a sealed bottom, uh, zero to 100 kilometers an hour in 3.8 seconds. <laughs> so if you need that coffee at Tim Hortons, this is the car for you. <laughs> I'm trying to think of what I need a car. This car will do top speed, 335 kilometers an hour. Uh, so if I'm late to work, it's the, it's the right car. <laughs> <laughs> Again, you know, it's, uh, yeah, it breaks all the speed limits in first gear, but, um, you know, it's a car made with the Mercedes-Benz technology and McLaren partnership. It's been a great partnership uh, for the last five years. It's just a piece of history, and it's uh, exclusive, and I think that's what buyers want. Do you tell them that they can ever achieve the car's potential <laughs> in, the, in their lifetime? We, uh, we really advise them not to on the city roads, otherwise <laughs> it'll be in uh, Mr. Fantino's hands for a week. But uh, we do a lot of programs in Europe where they can use one of our pool cars and get the full benefit of the vehicle's performance. Oh, is that the deal? If you buy one in Canada, you get a loaner in Europe? Absolutely. We have a lot of programs we run with our AMG uh, uh, side of the company and events and SLR McLaren as well in France, Germany, Italy, Czechoslovakia, all over the place. Yeah, it's really great stuff. So Stephen, let us lift that carbon fiber hood and uh, see what makes it go. Ooh, there it is, and it's uh, almost midships. It is. It's considered front mid-engine design and uh, it just gives you a very nice uh, balance. Uh, and, and, and because the motor is a dry sump motor with a separate oil reservoir, the motor can be low. you have a very low uh, uh, center of gravity again, so a very small sump pan. So no oil is in the bottom of the engine, it's all contained separately in it. So you're trying to get as much weight behind the front axle as exactly. possible. Exactly, and that's exactly what Jeremy was saying was where the motor's positioned, he's quite correct in that. Um, it's supercharged, it's uh, 617 horsepower, 575 foot-pounds of torque, so you're in control of quite a bit here going on, but it's, it's, it's bulletproof. I mean, you know, you can track them, drive them home, drive them to the racetrack, race them, come home, have dinner, whatever. It's just a great car all around. Um, and Stephen, this is like the uh, parachute, is it? This is called an air brake, Michael. Um, actually, it'll trim up to about 30 degrees at anything over 98 kilometers an hour. Actually, let me show you. Okay. okay. Let me show you how this works. I'll just reach in and I'll show you. Now, this is where it will run on the highway. Oh, I see. Downforce. And it gives you some downforce, mm -hmm. plants your mm -hmm. rear end nicely to the ground. And there's a sensor in the brake pedal, actually, under hard braking application, and it will make it come right to the top. So it actually helps yep. you assess the car. Yep, there yeah, you it's go. It's considered an air brake and uh, not a new design, but certainly perfected by McLaren. Yeah. And I were you doing 300 kilometers an hour. It has Every an little effect. bit helps. <laughs> you yeah, bet. You got yeah. it. To bring back the spirit of the 50s, that was a gullwing door. Yeah, sort of a gull, gull wing, yeah. Yeah, that yeah. uh, yeah. makes it interesting to get in. Do you know those seats that you're looking at right there, those red ones? Yeah. Even they're carbon fiber. Yeah, and custom made to the uh, buyer's derriere. <laughs> exactly. Let me see if I can wiggle into this. Cool starter button. Ooh, listen to that. Did you hear that? That is the sound of a speeding ticket. <laughs> Onward. 
police must hunt for these things. Everyone would want to bag an SLR. Well, you know, it fills up their lonely little lives with something exciting, and they can cuff you, take you to jail, <laughs> confiscate the car, and make themselves very happy. Oh, the feel of this is superb. I mean, it's heavy and powerful, but you, you just feel like you have pinpoint control of it at all times. It's not as big a car from the inside as it is uh, as you look at it from the outside. Yeah. I mean, that big long nose looks like a monster, but when you just touch the steering wheel, bam, it just responds. You touch the brakes, bam. And you know those brakes? They're ceramic brakes. Mm -hmm. I mean, they yeah. just bring Weigh you... Weigh nothing and last forever. And bring you down from huge speeds to nothing faster than you can get to those huge speeds. <laughs> well, you want some features for your half million bucks, after all. What do you think really lives with these cars? I mean, could you live with this car on a day-to-day -day basis? No, no, no. I'd be arrested and hauled off to jail day one. Okay, what's your dream trip in it then? You're sitting here, you're enjoying it. Well, this thing would be great to go thundering through the Alps. I would love to do something like that. Or no speed limit autobahns, but uh, no point having it here. And uh, who would pay for your gas? <laughs> Exxon Mobil. <laughs> Bring the tanker. <laughs> And it's an extinct piece of technology because the uh, Mercedes-McLaren relationship has gone kaput. So if you uh, want an SLR, move fast. After the break, Cato hits the track in the SLS AMG.